third year of the Kimberley Nines here at Cable Beach. It's a great initiative by Purple Hands Foundation. Every year it gets bigger and better. I'm actually really overwhelmed with how it's grown over the last three years. This year is the biggest one yet, and most importantly, the smiles get bigger as well. We're so fortunate to have this parcel of land at the iconic Cable Beach to conduct this carnival. This year we've got our AFL players Josh Corbett and Connor Williams and AFLW players Michaela Morrison up here with us. What's so special about that is that the students can see them. You can't be what you can't see. For them to actually be able to see AFL and AFLW players running around and playing with them, it opens their minds to, hang on, this could be me. Yeah, it's been amazing and especially the girls, um, just how they jump straight into it. I love coming back and like seeing all the young indigenous people like running around playing footy and having fun. I was able to rope into a few games, which was good fun. So, um, yeah, some unbelievable talent up here. There's big kick! Join in the action! Bang! Oh. Are you having fun today? Yeah. <laughs> good goal! Nice! You are a very good player. Very good player. Starkick and the All Abilities Football Association WA have come on board and we now have an inclusion pitch. And it really means that regardless of situation or circumstance, you can come and play football on the beach. WA Police have a, a huge presence as part of this and supporting what we do. We've got officers umpiring, playing, it's uh, just terrific. A magnificent opportunity for basically the police officers to get involved with the young kids in a really positive environment and try and build those relationships up. We lean on our community-based partners, we lean on our organisations that we know have the same interest as us. Organisations like Containers for Change, Holdfast, DP World, Able Electrical, and then bringing Football Commission and Gondra. It's just phenomenal how this just grows and grows, but I think when everyone's pulling in the same direction, the only direction is forward. It's been a tremendously uh, important partnership for us. You know, we're a grassroots community-based organisation. It's a fantastic opportunity for us to reach out to uh, Kimberley kids in this fun sort of sport environment. The amount of volunteers and support that get it all up throughout the day, it's such an amazing thing and it's only three years into it all, it feels like it's been going on forever. With the WA Good Food Guide, we offered the opportunity for um, students to have a dining experience up on the lawn and here at the surf club where we're able to um, provide a three course meal. The kids sat at beautifully uh, decorated tables and, and had a dining experience where they, um, that sense of real value for them uh, and respect towards them was shown and they've made the night uh, one of the truly memorable elements of this event. These stories of fun, of mateship, of playing football, of opportunity, they're gonna, they're gonna span across the Kimberley tonight and we can't wait for that. Oh, what the